If Michael Corleone, the head of the Corleone crime family in the Godfather series, were assassinated and his older brother Fredo were made the new Don, the future of the Corleone empire would be drastically different. Let's explore this scenario in detail, Fredo's leadership style. Fredo Corleone is very different from his brother Michael. Fredo is depicted as more emotionally driven, less intelligent, and not as strategic or ruthless as Michael. Here are some key aspects of how Fredo might handle being Don. Emotional decision-making. Fredo tends to let his emotions guide his actions. This could lead to inconsistent and impulsive decisions that might not be in the best interest of the family or the business. Lack of respect. Within the mafia world, respect and fear are crucial for maintaining power. Fredo's reputation for being weak and easily manipulated means he would struggle to command the same level of respect that Michael did. Poor strategic skills. Fredo lacks the cunning and strategic mind that Michael possesses. This deficiency would make it difficult for him to outmaneuver rival families and maintain the family's position of power. Immediate consequences. In the short term, Fredo becoming Don would likely result in several immediate problems. Internal dissent. Key members of the Corleone family and their allies might not support Fredo's leadership. This could lead to internal conflicts and possibly even attempts to replace him. Increased vulnerability. Rival crime families would see Fredo as an easy target. They might take advantage of his weakness to attack the Corleone family, seize their territories, or disrupt their operations. Financial instability. Poor leadership decisions could lead to bad investments, loss of business opportunities, and decreased profits. Fredo's inability to make sound business decisions would harm the family's financial health. Long-term effects. Over time, the negative impact of Fredo's leadership would become more pronounced. Loss of power and influence. The Corleone family would likely lose its dominant position within the mafia hierarchy. Rival families could take over their territories and operations, diminishing the Corleone family's influence and control. Increased risk of betrayal. Fredo's leadership could lead to more betrayal from within the family. Disgruntled members might seek alliances with rival families or law enforcement to undermine Fredo's position. Legal troubles. Without Michael's strategic mind to keep law enforcement at bay, the Corleone family might face increased scrutiny and legal challenges. This could result in arrests and convictions of key members, further weakening the family. The likely collapse of the empire. Given these challenges, the Corleone empire would likely face a slow but steady decline under Fredo's leadership. The once powerful and feared family would lose its grip on power, becoming a shadow of its former self. Fredo's inability to lead effectively would ultimately lead to the disintegration of the family's criminal empire. In summary, if Michael Corleone were assassinated and Fredo became the new Don, the Corleone family's power and influence would significantly diminish. Fredo's weaknesses as a leader would lead to internal conflicts, vulnerability to external attacks, financial instability, and eventually, the collapse of the Corleone crime empire. If you've gained anything from this video, then don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the No Aim, No Gain YouTube channel. For every video is a step closer to your goals.